The overall goal of the following experiment is to examine the connections among brain areas that are important for social cognition in autism using functional MRI and diffusion tensor imaging of the brain in both children and adults with autism. This is achieved by designing appropriate fMRI experiments, then recruiting autistic participants. The participants must be adequately prepared for the procedure to obtain quality functional and structural brain images. The functional experiments are presented to the participant in the MRI scanner while performing a predefined task. The MR images acquired result in a relatively large amount of data for each experiment. The acquired neuroimaging data are transferred to the lab's computer server, then pre-processed and subjected to statistical analysis by creating models. In addition to the basic brain activation analysis, the functional and anatomical connectivity is examined in autism and control participants. fMRI results are obtained that show reduced activation and weaker functional connectivity during social cognition in autistic subjects. In addition, DTI data analysis indicates abnormal white matter integrity in autism. This method can answer important questions regarding the brain organization and brain functioning in autism spectrum disorders. And potentially one day uh, this can lead to identifying a neurological marker for autism. The implications of this technique extend toward therapy for autism because identifying altered connectivity among brain regions could lead to developing new therapies that mend those connections. So though this method can be used to assess the autistic brain, it can also be used in other techniques such as looking at other uh, neurodevelopmental disorders.